Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about teethers. Um, I have a huge variety, I've done a lot of research, so I think um, you'll be able to find something depending on your baby's motor skills and what kind of texture they like. And yeah, so let's get started. Okay, so the first tea that I have is this one right here. This is called the Manhattan Winkle Toy Teether. Um, the exact names and everything will be down in the description bar. I would say this is like a good all-around teether, especially for um, when your baby's younger and they're just beginning to like hold things because this is really easy to grab. There's so many different parts and this is like a little chewable rubber thing and it has a little rattle and it's really easy to grasp with two hands. Um, so I think this would be a great starting teether. She saw her like this in the beginning, but as she grew older, she lost interest. But I've also read that a lot of babies have used this from 8 months plus. So yeah, this is really good and it has great reviews. The second type of teether that I have, um, they're both by Newbie. And I'd say these are for definitely early, early teethers. Um, or babies that never took a pacifier. There are these kinds of teethers. They basically look like pacifiers. I'll show you this one. I'll show you this one right here. And um, these are great for babies who are really young and they can't really hold stuff yet. And my baby, she never really took a pacifier. Um, or if your baby is starting to chew on their pacifiers, I think these are great options because I wouldn't want a baby associating chomping on a pass a nipple shaped object, especially if you're breastfeeding. So yeah, these are really great. Zara still um, loves these. Um, she's almost nine months now. So these are great and they're by Newbie. And they're really um, affordable as well. Next tea that I have is just so adorable and so cute. It's the baby banana teether right here it's made out of um, this silicone type material and it has these little bristles and for some reason I was reading reviews about this on Amazon and I'm like why would this be such like an amazing teether like I just didn't get it but now I get it and you have to get it too because it's just awesome she like loves this thing it's supposed to it's advertised as a teether and an early toothbrush um, because it has a silicone material it does pick up lots of bits and dirt and stuff so you have to wash it quite frequently um, with all the teethers I read they're all safe to chew on so I uh, did my research on that yeah so this is really really highly recommended this is a great teether and uh, your baby will be sure to love it <laughs> so the next teether I have is also by newbie I just love their products it's this one right here it's the newbie teeth easy teether with bristles um, it's also made out of silicone this can also be put in the fridge or the freezer so it can uh, offer extra comfort to the gums it has these like bristles on the top and on the sides and um, I feel like this is like really satisfying to chew on for your baby and very soothing and this is just overall a great product Sara loves this and I highly recommend it Moving on, the next teether I have is by Komatomo um, Silicone Teether. Um, this one is very interesting. I call it her carrot fingers. Um, I was kind of hesitant to buy this, but if your baby loves to chew on their fingers, then this is going to be a hit. Um, it has these like baby finger sized uh, little what would you call these sticks <laughs> on here it has like a round circle so it's easy to hold and they're just not they're like this is the right size so your baby won't gag on them because i know my sara she used to put her fingers in her mouth earlier on especially she would gag on them a lot because the baby's gag reflex is like really strong so yeah i really think that this would be a great teether um if your baby loves to chew on their fingers <laughs> So the next tea that I have, I don't actually have it with me, but I'll put a picture right here. It's the Key Icy Bite Keys by Newbie. Um, they're, they're really good as a toy as well. They're really easy to hold onto. They can also be put in the fridge or the freezer. And they have a bunch of different like sides to chew on. You can even chew on the ring itself that holds the keys on it. So it's really awesome tea there and I really recommend it. Yeah, I wish I had the keys themselves to show to you guys, but um, I have no idea where they are because a lot of these teether toys I keep in the car for Sara and I just don't know where it's gone to right now and the last teether we're going to talk about I also don't have it with me but I'm sure all you mamas out there and mamas to be knows about Sophie the giraffe 
Um, she is all very on the expensive side of teethers, but she's made of all natural rubber and she's a squeak toy. And yeah, babies just love chewing on Sophie the giraffe. And I don't even have to say anything because she speaks for herself. So those are my recommendations for teethers. They're very, uh, there's a huge variety here and I'm sure you'll be able to find something that will help soothe your baby and also keep your baby entertained because babies love chewing on stuff. So yeah, that's my video for this week and I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Bye!